beginning when it was there, it was going to be a private area that everybody just couldn't come in and out. You were going to have a gate there that you had to be, as you were not a resident there, you had to sign in. Now, what happened to that? Is that something going to be later, or is it just banned forever? No, at that time, uh, we owned the right of way, and uh, we gave it to the county. And as the commissioner said, uh, when county roads are open, it's for everybody. You can't gate them. You can't gate them. Ms. Cassidy? Yes. I'm going to say something about Urban's Road. That road went all the way into what is now called Lake Alapaha. I was born, not raised out there on Urban's Road when it didn't have a name. And before that was the Lake Alapaha. So that road, Urban's Road, goes all the way through. And I don't know what you got there that you got to cut out. The only thing that's in the place of, in front of that road is ever who built those buildings or whatever at the end of it between Lake Alapaha Road and Urban's Road. The red grader, unless he's quit, goes all the way down to right there close to the end of that road in terms of ramp. But I lived out there when I was in the first grade and the second grade and that road went all the way through in there. It knows, okay. There's no wooded area growed up to where that road went to. Any other? Mr. Rouse okay. has several questions, but he had an emergency, and so he said he'll come back and share the questions with us later. So we can move on with the agenda. There's oh. no more questions. I, I have some more, another question okay. about 